Hey guys, it's Jesse, and today I thought I would do another Amazon Essentials video. I looked it up. I did one of these in January 2018, so it's been over a year. Um, so that means I have like over a year's worth of stuff uh, that I am obsessed with that I bought on Amazon that I wanted to share today. Most of these are things I purchased within the last like six months or so, but these are definitely things um, that I use regularly on the reg. And so I thought I would share uh, some of them today. I personally love watching these Amazon videos on YouTube. It's one of my favorite things to watch, although then it leads me to buying more things on Amazon. So it's like a never ending cycle. But I'm definitely an Amazon addict. Um, I hate leaving my house like completely. I work from home. I like being home. I like being with my dogs. And I live in Atlanta where there is lots of traffic all the time. So I love buying stuff online and having it delivered straight to my house because it means I don't have to leave the house. I don't have to get into traffic. I don't have to get annoyed, get aggravated, raise my blood pressure, want to go on a murderous psychotic rage. You get the idea. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into some of my Amazon favorites. First thing that I have is my camera bag. This is the camera bag that I travel with when I do travel, which isn't too often, but it has gotten used a little bit recently. Um, and this is the Altura Photo Camera Sling Backpack. The reason I was drawn to this is because it's a great price. It's only $30. Um, and I love that it has the sling, so you can wear it crossbody. It's also not super huge, which I have kind of like a love-hate relationship with because I feel like I actually want this to be a little bit bigger. Um, but I do also really like that it's small, it's easy to pack, um, and it holds. A, it actually holds a fair amount of stuff. It's got this strap, it's a very secure. Here's the inside, it holds uh, my big DSLR camera. It can also hold my small camera. Also, I've traveled with several cameras with this. You can put lenses in here, you can hold everything. The only thing that I don't love about the inside of this bag is that these Velcro things like really can only be in one position. Yes, they have the Velcro, you can move them, but they don't work well together. They don't mold well together if they're out of this position. Um, so that's kind of annoying. If I had a bigger bag or say a backpack, a bigger backpack, I know that those sections kind of move around a lot easier, but um, I don't really want to have a huge backpack. I don't have that much camera equipment. Usually if I go anywhere, I only take like one camera. Um, so that's not like a huge deal for me. There's also storage up here. I tend to keep just little accessories and chargers or whatever in there. But yeah, just a super fun kind of like easy low maintenance camera bag. Another camera accessory uh, item that I have here is the Tenba Cable Duo for Cable Pouch. I actually got this because I saw Stephen Perkins talking about this. Um, over on their channel and I was like, yes, I actually do need that in my life. Um, this thing is so awesome. I've only had it a couple weeks and I haven't gotten to travel with it yet. Um, but it already is like serving such a great purpose, even just sitting in the house. I put cables here. I keep the camera chargers and batteries and any other like little loose accessories in here all in one place. I feel like I have so many different places for camera equipment, but I still can never like find what I'm looking for. Maybe I need to be a little more organized. Maybe that's on me. Um, but I think this will be awesome for traveling because I can put all my cords and cables in here. I also have my little like Apple plug in here so I can charge any of my Apple products or really anything with a USB into a wall. So that's pretty awesome. I love that it's clear. I love the head. Oh my God. It's just like everything. Like this is just the perfect size. I can put this in my camera bag or a different bag and just know that I have everything in one place. One last camera accessory that is kind of new, but I've also been using it a lot and I love it, is this Photo Pro camera tripod, a 48 inch phone tripod with three way head, smartphone tripod for iPhone X, Samsung, blah, 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 DSLR, you get the point. Um, this thing, first of all, I love how compact it is when it's all folded together. 
it is so small and um, I don't think I showed, I didn't show you on the camera bag, but it has a spot so you can attach a tripod to the side of the backpack. And this hooks up perfectly. It also has these different um, mounts on the top so that you can mount your camera or your phone or anything. I bought myself an early birthday present and got the DJI Osmo Pocket um, last week and so I got the kit for that so that I can also mount that on here if I want to. It's just like an awesome little lightweight tripod. I love that it has the moving head. I feel like a lot of these smaller tripods don't have kind of like the bells and whistles that this one does, this one comes with and it's only $30 which I thought was very reasonable. Another really cool thing is right here, it comes with a uh, remote so you can use that with your camera and you can't lose it because it is right there. This is so awesome. Okay, onto some other just random weird things that don't really fit into a category. It's just things that I like, such as my life. So I got AirPods a couple months ago and I love them because I have weird shaped ears and I hate earbuds that have the like squishy that go like inside your ear. I know that's a really interesting way of describing it, but I love the Apple. I've always loved the Apple earbuds because they just like sit on your ear, but I did find them to be like a little uncomfortable and I'm always worried about them falling out of my ear. So I got these ear buddies, ear hooks and covers for the earbuds. They're really cool. They're blue, they look like this. There's a right one and a left one. Maybe that's the left one. Nope, that's another right one. So this is super easy. You just like pop these on to your earbuds, your AirPods. Make sure that all of the holes line up. Like so, like literally takes two seconds. The only issue with these, and this is what everyone online, all the reviews say also, is that obviously you can't have these on while you are, um, while they're in the charging case. Ooh, lost my train of thought. But, but honestly, it takes like so little time to put on that it really doesn't bother me. And they're totally awesome. And they make it so you just pop it in your ear. Just like that. It just sits comfy in your ear, secure in your ear, just like that. It's a little thing, but it makes a big difference. Um, and. It was $11 and it comes with three pairs of these. I'm not sure how these will wear, like if they fall apart really easily or what, um, but three pairs should last me for a little while. Next is another stupid thing that I'm like really excited about. I got this little handheld fan. Uh, this is the Tripole handheld mini fan, battery operated. It was $12 on Amazon um, and it is awesome. It has two speeds. And I have been loving, um, after I put on setting spray, when I put my makeup on, I use this to dry my face and let everything settle. And it's perfect, it's awesome, it's little, compact, yada, yada, yada. We're also going to Florida, so I'm definitely taking this with me to try and beat the heat and humidity. Okay, this next item is something else that doesn't seem like it would be that exciting, but I literally use it every day. That is the Trudeau Toss and Chop Salad Tongs. I literally eat a giant chopped salad for lunch every single day. And these make it so easy and fast to chop my salad. This is actually my second pair of these. I had my, I got the first pair, I think like 10 years ago. They lasted forever and then finally the like spring in it gave out and I was just like, you know what? It's just gonna be easier to replace them and buy a new pair of these. These are $12, like honestly the best $12 that I personally probably have ever spent. I just throw all of my ingredients that I want in my salad into the bowl. I have like a metal salad bowl that I use and then you just go, here I'll demonstrate. You just go and everything gets nice and combined and perfect. If you're a salad lover like me, I highly recommend investing the $12 to buy these because once again, I'll use them every single day. Okay, some other food things, I guess. Um, I talked about this in my keto video that I did a while ago, but truly love it. That is my Better Stevia Liquid Stevia. As I've mentioned before, I used to be a massive sweet and low addict. I would only put sweet and low in my coffee. Um, and when I started doing keto, I was like, 
I don't think I like stevia. But then I got hooked on this and I love it. I put this in everything, put this in coffee, in tea. I make my own salad dressing and I put it in my salad dressing. I will make up whipped cream and put this in my whipped cream. Like it is so good. Even Ben likes this now. Ben has gotten totally hooked on this. So we go through this a fair amount. This is eight ounces. It is like just under $17 for this, which seems a little steep, but it does last a while. Um, if one person is using it, if two persons are using it, then it lasts a little bit shorter. Um, but still, it has like a lot in here and you really only need a few drops. And it's just so tasty. I've gotten like everyone hooked on this. It's so amazing. Next is another kind of coffee related item um, and that is these tumblers. I actually got these for some people for Christmas and used my Cricut and made designs on them. And I like the tumbler so much, I actually got one for myself. This is the Simple Modern 20 ounce Cruiser Tumbler. It says it's currently unavailable um, from the link that like I bought it from on Amazon, but I'm sure that there are more. I know that they make a 30 ounce, it's like $20. So I think this one was like $15. It is just as good as the Yeti. I have a Yeti, I have other imitation Yetis. Um, I refuse to pay $40 for a tumbler, like that's just insane. But this I feel like works just as well as a Yeti. Like it's amazing, it will keep my coffee hot. When I put hot coffee in here, it literally lasts like six hours still like scalding hot. It's ridiculous. Uh, so I highly recommend these, especially if you're looking for an alternative to spending $40 on the Yeti. Yes. A couple years ago, I started getting into essential oils. Um, I bought a pack of essential oils on Amazon. I think they're the Rada Beauty uh, essential oil like blends. And I got an oil diffuser and I was diffusing oils a lot. Um, and then those kind of ran out and I kept buying more essential oils. And I was like, I need somewhere to put these. They were just in a heap in my nightstand. So of course I went on to Amazon to find a solution to this very disturbing problem and I found this essential oil case. This is from Pure Glow, it is $10. If you have a massive essential oil collection, uh, it probably won't fit in this. This says it holds 30 and it actually is deceivingly big. I have quite a few in here. Um, but I don't, I don't have a huge collection of essential oils. I just have some kind of like basics. And if it's perfectly in here, they're all in one place. I don't have to go digging around trying to find the one that I can't find. Everything is here. I also bought the uh, stickers. I think these are the doTERRA stickers, which I don't have the doTERRA oils, but there's a lot of overlap in the flavors. Uh, so I bought these to put on the top of my lids so that I could easily grab them. So you can see. When I opened up this case, all the smells of the oils came and hit me in the face and it smells so good. I just like the black, but if you want something crazy, uh, this comes in a whole bunch of different like colors and patterns. And it also, if you want to travel with it, it also has a handle, which is pretty cool. Okay, and the last thing I have here is something that if you are a neurotic dog mom like I am, you should probably have. Hank had a collar break at one point and I thought the leash had broken and I'm always paranoid that he's going to somehow get his collar off his leash while we're walking and go running off. Um, so I looked on Amazon and found this leash which actually has a carabiner to attach to the collar and like literally it's like a locking carabiner like you have to have fingers in order to get it off. This is by the brand Embark Pets. This is the Sierra Leash Mountain Climbing Rope Leash with Carabiner. Um, I think this is actually meant like if you go mountain climbing with your dog. Uh, my dogs don't go mountain climbing but they are just crazy. This was $24 which I think is great for a leash. It's actually like really good quality. It's really thick. Um, and it's like well constructed and it's like, I feel like it's very secure. It's like, that has the knots. I actually just bought another one of these for Cooper cause I am a nerd who likes to have like matching things and Cooper has gone through a couple leashes. He has like the cheaper leashes um, that I would like to him to have like a more secure leash. Hey, I don't worry about like if he got off his leash or out of his collar, he probably wouldn't go anywhere. But Hank is a little demon and I don't even know what he's capable of. 
Okay, so that concludes my current can't live without Amazon essentials. Let me know in the comments down below if you're addicted to Amazon also and what your current favorite Amazon products are. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.